Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hello if you're new. Today I have a product from Pantene. It's been a while since I've tried one of their products and they've been a bit hit and miss as I've tried them. Someone recommended to try the Intense Hydration Surge with Biotin and Baobab Essence Sorbet Mask. Sounded really nice. Like I said, Pantene is just a product range that sometimes they work really, really well and I'm really impressed by how affordable the products are and how well they work on my hair. Other times I'm left a little bit disappointed and expecting a little bit more because I think that the hair care space, especially for the affordable market, has elevated so, so much. There's so many great options. This could be a great option if you are looking to improve the health of your hair. However, your budget is minimal. Pantene, as ever, is super, super affordable. I believe I got this from Superdrug. It would have only been a couple of pounds too. I love mixing up my content whereby I do really affordable products and also those that are a little bit more expensive and this just is exactly that. This is a super affordable product where you get tons and tons in here. So like I said, not everyone wants to spend lots and lots of money on really, really high-end products. It's really important to test and try it. Those are super affordable and see if they work for me. And I can obviously compare them to ones I try that are a little bit more expensive. So with that said done, let's dive straight into the video. Okay, so I've just shampooed out my hair and I had a little look at the receipt on this product. So I got this from Boots and I paid $4.99, which again, for a hair mask generally is very affordable. And a tub of this size, you're gonna get a good amount of uses out of it too. But we're here to see if it works very well. Oh my God, I just got a whiff of that. That smells amazing. Oh, it smells really good. So yeah, I'm here to test whether or not it works. That's ultimately why we want to test as many hair care products as possible, but it sounded like it would work amazing. So this says it's going to deeply quench and bring moisture back to every hair strand, smooths cuticles and reveals a healthy glow. So this is one that you can leave on for just a short amount of time. It's claiming you'll get results between one to three minutes. Consistency of this is very kind of jelly-like. Well, that's quite unusual. So yeah, it's claiming you can get results between one to three minutes. I leave all my hair masks on for half an hour. Just gives the best results, honestly. And if you can stretch the time, you're gonna get the most out of the products that you use on your hair. If you can leave them on overnight, typically, especially those that are promising like moisture, you're gonna get such incredible results. Wow, that feels really nice in my hair needed a tiny amount of that and it's gone so far i like that see can you see the consistency of that it's just slightly unusual yeah let me continue applying this all over So I've had to use hardly any of that product. A little bit went such a long way, which is amazing. So it claims that this is also really gonna help the glow of your hair, which is quite an unusual thing to say, but I think it's gonna really help to enhance shine, especially where hair just feels a little bit dull. That's definitely the case with my hair as I started this video, and already this feels like it's made such a great difference in manageability. Shampooing my hair also helped to get that product build up off, and now I'm treating the lips and ends, but I do bring hair masks up to the scalp and work them down, just because I find that it gives such a great result, and I also find that hair masks are great for concealing flyaways when I dry them. It really helps to hydrate and prevent breakage on top that can make you have like loads of flyaways and stuff, which is something I tend to avoid so anything like this is great to just put all over comb through it with your fingers to make sure that it's all in every strand essentially if you have thicker hair section your hair and apply it that way that will also work really well but if you have thinner hair like me then this technique is absolutely fine just make sure you've got every single bit of your hair and then what you can do at this point is just leave it down if you're going to leave it on for just a few moments you can put your hair up in like either a scrunchie or i love invisible balls they're like my favorite and what i would do as well if you are leaving this on overnight get your hair twist it 
and put it in a bun as you twist it like so then it's going to keep the product really just moisturized and saturated in your hair so that it stays and doing its thing you don't want it to dry out or make your hair kind of clumpy so i find that that's the best way also if you're going to sleep in it wear like a shower cap or something that's going to protect your hair against surfaces that prevents friction but it also prevents the product getting anywhere but yeah in this video i'm going to leave this on for 30 minutes as i do all of my other hair mask videos and we shall see how this compares and works because i'm so excited especially when it comes to like really affordable hair masks there wasn't that many options years ago whereas now there's so many options i'm here to help you find what ones work for you so yeah i'll see you guys at once half an hour has been and gone we shall see how it's sitting on my hair has it dried out much has it stayed moisturized i'm really intrigued to know and then i will show you the results at the end of this video and we shall see how well this has worked because i'm excited intense hydration surge i'm gonna be able to know if my hair is hydrated or not so we shall see pantene if you are telling the truth so i'm back half an hour has been and gone and there's some areas of my hair that have dried up more so than others it seems really weird because like that's an example there where it's a lot drier but some areas are still really moisturized let's look at the ends they still look absolutely fab actually which is great because that is where especially if you suffer with split ends you want to make sure that your ends are really really saturated it's kind of gone a bit weird at the top here I mean, it's okay at this point. It's not wowing me. It's like there's some areas of dryness which you don't typically get very often with hair masks. And it's at this check-in, I've been like, do I get rid of this check-in? Is it not very informative? But sometimes like this, where it's just handy to know how other products compare. Recent hair masks, others I've tried, there's been no change at this point. But this one definitely has a little bit, feels a little bit drier in specific areas. And yeah, something that I can definitely just feel and I'm just a bit aware of. So yeah, it's okay. It's not wowing me. I don't know what the result's going to be because at this point I'm not particularly excited and it's not the best feeling one I've ever tried. But we shall see how it goes. But yeah, I'll go and wash this out. I'll just dry my hair. I use my Dyson Supersonic to just dry it out and I use like the coldest setting on there just to prevent heat damage. So you shall see me next with my hair all washed and dried. We shall see how it's performed. I don't know. Let's see. I'm really excited. <laughs> I'm back. I'm obsessed. Like, can you see the amount of shine and softness? It looks really nice like this has worked so incredibly well this has definitely added intense hydration there's no better name for this product it's worked so well honestly my hair before was just feeling so dry and just horrid i hate it when my hair feels like this this feels like it's just rectified that straight away I've got so much hydration, so much moisture back. The ends also are looking very, very healthy. Oh, it's so soft. My brush glided for it so easily. I can't believe this has actually worked as well as it has. But there we go. I love it. I'm really, really am in love with that. I didn't expect to. Again, Pantena products that is hit and miss. This is a hit, this is incredible. Like I said, this was so, so affordable. And so hair care doesn't have to be expensive. And I think that that's something that I'm really passionate about getting across on my channel is that yes, I try the Olaplexes, the Aways, the Living Proofs, all of those kind of products that have a higher price tag. But if you are looking to get healthy looking hair, you're looking to start that hair care journey, you don't have to start at the top. You can start with products like this that really give incredible results. Yes, higher end ones typically have more science and better ingredients within them that's why there's typically that price up but also there's marketing to contend with they have a line that's particular in one market pantene is in the affordable space and so where i have seen the most impressive developments in hair care has definitely been the more affordable brands because they've really stepped up their game over the last couple of years which makes it really exciting for me to deliver these videos and share with you my results because I'm not just saying Olaplex is amazing and affordable products are bad. 
this is great if you're looking for hydration if you really suffer with dry hair and you're looking to get a very professional result this is going to deliver that for you and i really like it and i know not many people in the hair care space will say that but i truly do i think that this is a great product if you're looking to start out or you're just looking for something that's going to treat dry hair this could be a really great contender but this is the finished result super soft that's what i'm most impressed with it's so silky but it's so shiny and soft really really impressed with that so yeah let me know what you guys think are you as impressed as i am because honestly i actually can't get over the fact that this is such an affordable brand and this particular mask like i said their various products do vary in the way that they work for me and in terms of whether i would recommend them but this particular mask i'll have it linked down below if you want to find a link to it specifically but this is fantastic i really do like it so if you are looking for a recommendation this could be a really really great one it does have silicone within the formula so take that with a pinch of salt i know some people prefer not to have silicones within their formulas some don't mind it's completely up to you your preferences that's why i try to just try as many various products as i can on this channel just to give you my various recommendations based on what you're looking for so yeah that is my two cents on this product i am so so impressed i actually can't believe it really like this if you are looking for a fantastic hair mask at a low price check this out I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I upload twice a week. If you're new here, I would love for you to subscribe. It means so, so much. And honestly, any support just means I can continue making videos like this and trying as many products as I can so that you can find the best products to add to your collection. So yeah, that's all from me in today's video. I hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you guys super soon. Bye.